If you can remember last day we have learned how you can use transition on your video clips and today I'm going to show you how you can use transition for your audio clips. So why you need to use audio transition? Sometimes you are talking and you are making a cut when you are talking and when you are combining these two clips the sound will feel so harsh right for that kind of scenario you can smoothen up a little bit using audio transition so how you can use audio transition in adobe premiere pro i have already opened a project in adobe premiere pro i'll put a link in the description below of this exact same project you can download it you can practice with me so here on this video you can see there is a cut if i play it back different courses so my goal is to like educate but if you want to smoothen up it a little bit you can use the transition to use the transition you need to go to effects panel which is here then you can click audio transition folder then you can click crossfade and there you'll see three different transition for audio there isn't a lot of transition for your audio you can use this three transition for your audio clip so what this transition is doing right if i click and drag this transition here on my audio clip it will apply here and if i click here you can see in the fx control panel there is a curve right so if i play it back now different courses so my, you can see the audio is overlapping right to make the duration of this transition a little bit shorter you can click and drag it just like that and now if you play it back courses so my it will sound much smooth so what is this constant power is doing if you click here then you will see in the effects panel it is lowering the volume of my first audio track and on the other hand it is increasing the volume of my second audio track and you can see there is a grab right there is a grab if i apply constant gain it is not doing the same thing and it is increasing the volume of the second track directly there isn't any is in or is out for that reason i like to use constant power a little bit and that is my default transition to make any transition your default transition you can right click here and then you can click set selected as default transition so that's it if you want to apply constant power anywhere on your video then you can just right click and then apply default transition it will apply the default transition for video and audio together if you just want to apply audio transition on a clip then you have to press or then right click here and now you can click and then apply default transition it will apply the default transition for that audio track only i like to use constant power transition at the end of my video so that when it is ending started shall we the audio goes down very gradually so that's it that is how you can use audio transition in adobe premiere pro if you have liked this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up and if you need this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro or video editing then you can subscribe to this channel to get more video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye